Prior to the use of Everstick Post, the root canal of the tooth were endodontically treated and filled using generally approved methods. Everstick Posts are available in three different diameters, 0.9, 1.2 and 1.5 millimeters. The most suitable size can thus be selected for canals of different sizes and shapes. The temporary filling was removed. Two-thirds of the length of the Gutta Percha root canal filling was removed using Largo Burr. Gates Glidden Burr can also be used. The canal was rinsed with saline and dried carefully using paper points. A root canal was etched according to the cement manufacturer's instructions. The root canal was then rinsed and dried using paper points. The depth of the prepared canal was measured using a periodontal probe. Also the height of the coronal structure to be needed was estimated. The post was cut to a suitable length with sharp scissors. The end of the post was tapered with sharp scissors. The post was fitted inside the root canal. An additional post was shaped and attached to the main post, coronally, with a thin layer of enamel resin to increase strength of the coronal part. The shaped post was light cured for 20 seconds inside the canal. The post was then removed from the canal and light cured on all sides for 40 seconds. A layer of enamel resin was applied onto the post surface to activate the IPN feature. The post was then covered from the light till it is cemented. The core matrix was placed and the root canal was bonded according to the cement manufacturer's instructions. Prior to cementation, an activating resin layer was thinned by carefully blowing the surface of the post with dry, oil-free air. Resin was then light cured thoroughly for 10 seconds. The canal was filled with dual cure cement, as instructed by the manufacturer. By filling the canal from the bottom and proceeding slowly by moving the syringe steadily upwards until the canal is filled. A post was inserted into the root canal. Excess cement was removed and the cement was light cured. The core was built up using composite core material. Treatment will be continued in the next visit, so the core was adjusted to the occlusion.